Welcome back to the Big Fit Part 1 Marauder. Um, we're still looking for a lot of it. Oh, is that an arrow? Did I miss that? It is. Oh, it's another rep arrow. This is convenient. <laughs> Maybe. Is that wood? No, there's another stone lintel. I think. We're having all these houses made out of obvious wood with obvious wooden beams. And yet, <laughs> doesn't work. Uh, oh well. You see, I've dealt with the music. <laughs> Turn the volume way down. Okay, so what I found out is the ladder is not usable, but you can rub your way up into those windows. It's just difficult. I don't know what to do about this one, I haven't checked it out. But we're in this area, so we should come back here, right? This window. So... This is the bottom edge of the... No, not there. Off by like a tiny fraction. No. Or was it the bottom of the shutters? I can't remember exactly what they said, but they said it is possible to shoot... to get up here with a rope arrow. Let's look in around again, see. No, the underside of the uh Maybe the side of the shutters is wood. Yes, that's very weird. Is that really intended? I don't know, because you can't really then climb onto the ledge. I don't know, it just feels super bizarre. Okay, well, this is one of the places we're supposed to check out, so we're checking it out. Get some more apples. These are nice, fancy interior doors. They're very... Very thin. Chest pieces. Is this some kind of puzzle, or just we can play the game? Another healing potion. That's a very uh, unusual sort of painting. I see, that looks valuable. But how would you get it? I mean, can't break that, right? This is glass in case it needs opening. I mean, if this is a traditional thief mission, I would say, oh, well, obviously the chest puzzle is a puzzle to open the glass case because, you know, just connecting the dots of random stuff in the mission. Oh. Chest pieces all around the outside, uh, all around the border there as well. It's not the case in this room. And they've got. Oh. Automatic lights. That's fancy technology. Huh. Hmm. The painting doesn't seem to move. Okay, it doesn't seem to see any kind of secret switch. Is it a puzzle? Because if so, it's... <laughs> extremely <laughs> opaque.
mean, there's numbers on the board and everything. One to eight down the sides there. Eight to eight going right to left. Oh, there's a... Queens should not threaten each other. Okay, 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 okay. They're all queens. Right. It is a puzzle, but... Uh, that makes it clear. Let's advance them all, because they all advance to different positions, right? And <laughs> we had it there for a second. Which ones are threatening each other right now? These two. No, now these two are threatening each other, so let's bring this one back. There we go. That's seriously it. It is a puzzle, though. Wow. That's just, again, that's just like... Feels extremely random and completely at odds with the entire tone the rest of the mission seems to be going for. It's like, let's do... Let's do a weird logic puzzle. On a table in this room, that opens a glass cabinet in the other room. It's not like they're wired together or there's anything obviously mechanical. It's just like, oh, we like playing chess and... Hey, we've got a weird way, way, way to open this thing. I don't know. I don't, I don't like that decision. Oh. Okay, maybe that's how you're supposed to get in here? Hmm. Oh, he's getting away. <gasps> How do you get up there? Maybe it's the other way around. Maybe that's you get in there. From that way. Oh, getting stuck in the tree. Oh, there's the lion's head. Right, the lion's head. It's just from, from this side, it's going to look like a weird, scammy face, but now I see it's the lion's head. Well, we can do this again, which is weird, but we can do it. And get on top of the shutter and maybe leap across the way that way. Does not feel right. <laughs> I'll take it. Oh shit. Why is he coming down here? Okay, he didn't hear me. He's just coming to park. Kind of funny, I'm eating an apple in the game while I'm also actually eating an apple. Whoops. Oh, shit. Why did that not mantle this time? <laughs> yeah, this is so weird. Like, design wise, like. Did you test this? Or was the result from testers just like, I don't know. That's clearly possible to get into, right? No, not like that. Don't, don't jump. Apparently jumping is... Yeah, because of, oh, of this damn overhang. There we go. That's super difficult for no particularly good reason. Mine. I mean, even getting into that window, which is like, okay, this is an odd place of interest. Looks, looked impossible until, yeah, I read that actually, yeah, you can rope a tiny, tiny bit of texture there, which is completely normal with this. I don't know. <coughs> oh, whatever. I have a couple of healing questions I don't need, right? No, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to try that again. Should be able to make it to the ledge. Bouncing off the damn roof is what's happening. <coughs> Alright, let's try... Let's just try... Uh, there we go. Diagonal run. 
And then this one I can drop down and maybe not hurt myself. Okay. So we're done with that one then. Guess we want to investigate this lion's head place. We haven't been here. Okay, so this is the line set place, right? So there's a locked door there. The map is so tiny that I can't even put a K. So I changed the font, of course, as well, for the map, which means I'm having trouble predicting how big my letters are going to be. Thieves Guild Notes. Seven Winds Porter, Entry 8. Far seen, Chess Grandmaster, lives in the House of Towers near to the southwest border of the quarter. He recently won a precious golden cup in a tournament and he's so proud of that fact he doesn't bother to hide it. The lock on his door is extremely complicated. Seems like he's done it himself. Entrance through the door found to be impossible, but there is a dormer window in the attic of the house opposite. Unfortunately, access to that attic is also problematic. Entry 9. Richard S. Pam, retired captain, lives together with his wife in the house on the wharf. He brought back an amazing diamond once from one of his voyages. He always brags about it, but never shows it to anyone. As he said, the diamond is very valuable, so he keeps it in a safe place. It's known that there is a spare key to his house which is hidden outside in case he loses his own. It should be somewhere near the house. Alright, that's useful knowledge. Wait, what did it call him? Richard S. Pam? Retired Captain. Okay, he's not the other guy we have notes on. I don't think. Oh, we're here. Again, okay, we're just going around in a circle. Then, which way was it to the... Right, we go up this way. And out along this street takes us to... The river. Nothing. Where are we now? This is the wrong place, this is the sleeping guy. Uh, I need to go way further east than this. It's not getting me east, it's getting me west. Don't get stuck in rubble. Lift your feet, lift your toes, Garrett. Round in a circle. Round, round, round in a circle. Oh, that's a different song. Hang on, 
we right back at the starting place now, aren't we? Yeah. So we do want to go that way. How did, I, how did I get here? I must have been through there. Right, yeah, there's the alley right there. And the wall we can climb over. You turn around right here, right? No? Oh, it's through here, right, 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 through this. Yeah, yeah what's this guy? What I'm gonna do. I'm just gonna go up and tell him. No more guard duty. Six tapping years of guard duty. I'm gonna put my finger up and say, uh, I had enough. That's it. Okay, so this is another set of people fighting that I haven't dealt with. <laughs> I guess I could have gone around instead of over, but you know, it feels more thiefly to go over. Okay, so he had the key somewhere outside his house. I didn't stop to observe where he might have put the key. Hides in his boat, okay. <gasps> what was that noise? Nothing, ma'am. Nothing. <sighs> yeah. Yes, is that you, sweetie? Me? Nothing in here. Didn't realise it was tile floor. It's funny though, I'm looking, standing there looking in the mirror and I'm creeping behind her. But the mirror doesn't work! Oh, a hairbrush. A mirror, don't work. Aren't very good, valuable either. Okay. I got a tiny, tiny house. Cheese, all right. With extremely tiny rooms. A mine? He keeps explosive mines just in an unlocked chest. That's not very safe, man. Who made that noise? Nobody. Valuable sextant? Probably not. <clears throat> I, mean, I can try knocking him out to see, but playing cards are probably not valuable. Captain's Diary, 28th. After long thought, I have decided to change the combination on the state clock. Now it is our wedding date, day and month. It will be of no help to my enemies who do not know the date, but I have nothing to conceal from my friends, except perhaps doubtful friends like Dr. L, who prefers to ignore my anniversary invitations. Okay, I bet we can find Dr. L's house and there'll be an invitation on it, right? Birdsbridge, Jailbridge. Oh, well, that's a, uh, it looks a bit like Tower Bridge, but, uh, an impressive bridge. But the safe is behind there, right? I had it. Oh no, there's the safe. So how would you enter a combination in that? Wouldn't expect me to see flare on top of that. Hmm. The place is so cramped you can barely move in it. I've been in bathrooms bigger than this bedroom. I almost say my flat's bathroom is bigger than this bedroom. Definitely bigger than this office. It's stuck here on the door. Come on. Alright. Surely the controls are behind that, right? 
save itself to open. It's got to be replaced into numbers. And it's a little weird. Unless it's behind this painting. This one's not labeled. Hmm. You must not. Okay, so he's gonna say Does that do anything? Does that like reveal the controls? Yes it does. For a moment. Okay, it's timed. Let's see how much time we get. Sometimes it reveals the controls. Six, seven, eight. Get about eight seconds. Okay. We know how to get find the controls now. Might take a couple of runs back and forth, put all the numbers in, but. Alright, we're going to need to find the combo. Um, B equals R and need day, month of wedding. Dr. Elves, huh? I don't remember seeing any sign for Dr. Elves anywhere. Wait, is there fighting going on up this way now? Oh yeah, there is. But I don't have any more... Flash bombs. I have a speed version I can get past them. 689? Right, we've been to the Chess Grandmaster, we've been to Pam, but we still need a diamond. Storage notes, Floodgate Caretaker. Wait, silver gear for Floodgate Caretaker. Let's uh, try going up river instead of this way, can we? No. What about down river? Oops. I mean, okay, we can go down river. Nothing here that looks like a floodgates house. I mean, there's that house, but. Hell R Sharpener. There's this name on a door, right? Maybe it should be worth noticing. Noting. Um, where is that door? That's just by this part of it. here. Two. There might be something else references it. So if I see more nameplates, you should just should just mark them. Oh, hello. Well, that's not super helpful. And get on this river here, this route here, which feels like we're not supposed to be up here. Little slightly, but it does feel like we're not supposed to be up here. So let's just go back down. Okay.
Right, we killed the two of them now already, right? Can I just run through this? I mean, silly question, right? In real life, absolutely not. In video game life, maybe? <laughs> yes, actually. Wait, have we not been here before? Right, we're here. Anyway, this seems like a bad idea, but I mean... As does fighting these guys. Get him! Okay, two at once. I'm not sure my equips take on two at once. Sold at the cost of a slight amount of health. Ooh, very healthy carrots. Alright, well, we'll take that as a health penalty. I don't know, this was super cheesy to do this in this mission, but I have no idea what else to do. It kind of feels like the author expects you to use the flash bombs as absolutely perfect. Absolutely perfect. Uh, wait, where did you come from? Did you just spawn? You were in exactly the same place as the other guy was. Was well, it exactly perfect efficiency? Going down, no, you're going down. These are objects. I wonder this is so hard. You've had it now. I'll find you. Believe me, I will. <laughs> I can't believe I lost him. I know you just ran around the building like that. So fast. Where did these objects? It's definitely looks like brushwork. Oh. Alright, add to the pile of purple bodies here. Big purple pile <laughs> of poop. Amazing how eager these guards are to stop fighting each these these mortal enemies are to stop fighting each other to chase some rando on the street who doesn't even look armed. I feel like some scripting has gone right there. Alright, let's murder the mechanist. So these guys do eventually kill each other, it just takes them a very long time apparently. I wonder if they just have a ton of health and like do like one damage each. Oh. 
And he has a bonus. Oh wow, 1189 now. So he saw somebody through these gates so they couldn't fight, so he decided to try and attack. But they're fighting in the fountain. They're fighting in the fountain. And the guy there has a purse as well, the archer. Can we reach that fountain? Is that this? Right. Okay, so let's put a... Another, another A is a bad idea. Three. Three eagles, archer, purse. And none of these guys have purses, right? We got the one who did. through there is going to be problematic. Right, so now we're here on the other side of the, the fire. Hmm, nothing? Something. Visual indications he has not determined. Alright, we, well, we can get back that way. We can go around... Which way? How would we get to this area? From up here? Hmm. Right in there. Unless we can rip over here, no, we can't rip over these gates. No way. Where, where the hell did you come from? You are fucking spawning. Or you run through the gates, which is, I guess, also possible. Uh, I can deal with more views. Onto the pile. I don't even have to move myself, but I will in case he's got. <coughs> he does not. Okay. It's very weird. So, like architecturally, this mission is amazing. Gameplay-wise, it's yeah, it's a thing. Just a little off about the time. I want to find my way back to the church, which is kind of north and west. Where did you come from? Guards! This way! Oh, we're at the church then. Right. So, if you remember the note on the weaponsmith said the gardener? Tell me about the gardener. This guy's a gardener, right? Is this where we found the flash bombs? Surely not, right? There's no spare key hiding in the boot. Yeah, 
There's a little alleyway, a little, a little passageway there, hallway with nothing in it. I wonder if the gardener has a spare key for the other guy's place. The weaponsmith, because he said something about the weapon, the gardener. I forget exactly what it, what it says. This is a gardener. Oh, we found a moss arrow in here, right? I don't, think, I don't remember finding anything else. No, the flash bombs are up in that other attic. Hmm. Hmm. And then there's this ledge, which... Doesn't really seem to have a purpose. Which is fine, it doesn't need to have a purpose, but it's... Very odd. Um, yeah, I think the flash bombs might have been in there. Maybe that was what the note was referring to? <laughs> I don't know. Alright. Map-wise, let's see if we can go east. Let's, let's go east. Back to the snoring man, maybe we can find a way in. Is there a way up in there? I don't remember where we saw the interior of that from. <laughs> from on top of here, right? <laughs> we just kind of vaguely see, but we can't get our head up high enough to see anything. I mean, I can try a rope arrow, but it's a very bad idea. Won't be able to get it back. I mean, maybe there's just nothing here. assumption because I don't think any other assumption is very fruitful right now. No open window there. Attic in the burnt building, but that's hang on. No, there's no hole in there. Hmm. <gasps> Terrible idea. How are we supposed to get to that? I mean... Well... That makes it possible. sure I want to save right now because that seems very, very, very silly use of a speed potion, but not a, maybe the intended use. Do you have anything else in here? Seems not. I'm supposed to get 
go in here that way. But it worked. So where are we now? We just cross here. So we can get down to the fountain and stuff. Okay. Is someone there? Nay. What? what? Guards! Help! Help over here! Guards! There's a thief! Hang on. Oh, okay. Back here. Hadn't saved. <laughs> So we heard the sting there, which meant our mysterious <laughs> invisible person was back again. Oh, come on. Oh. Not probably on the sting. <sighs> what the fuck? Yeah. I mean, I don't know if this is the way I'm supposed to do this, but I don't know any other possible way of getting up there. It feels very silly. I'm gonna do it again anyway. Mm -hmm. Ah, it's all about it's all about getting that mantle right. I managed to perfectly find the first couple of times, and now fucking it up. So it's a tiny, tiny, tiny ledge that you can't really stand properly on. That doesn't really help it. This mission was not built with any consideration for how the player character actually moves and all the jankiness in inherent in it. Shit, nearly there, but uh, got kind of pushed off at the last second. I do wonder if it might be easier for me to climb back on this wall and to leap across from this. Yeah, probably. Might try that next. Okay. Get this stuff again. Right, can I get back on. Excuse me. Can I get back on this wall? Yes. Alright, well, we save here. Use my speed potion, hopefully, I don't need it for anything else. This is not very. It's kind of tedious. So the problem before was she saw us and ran, which is maybe fine, but the other problem was I missed a mysterious appearance, hmm. I think. I thought I saw something. Good. I had not wanted to be disturbed. Well, there goes the thing again, but what is it? Who is it? And where? Is someone there? What? Guards! Help! Oh, there's a mysterious guy. He's got a blackjack, right? 
So that's what we got the sting for. And if we look away, does he go away? No. Now he goes away. Right. Well, she opened the door for us, which is very nice because I don't know how we would have gone in otherwise. Just another key that we could pickpocket. Worthless dice. Oh, you've got a key. Or the table had the key, I don't know which. Probably get you out of public view here. Sleep on the sofa. Oh. All these really tight places. Okay, what's this? Happy birthday, dear sister! We are all worried here about the damned war. One of my good friends has a relative in military intelligence. And he says that the enemy will never get further than the Travis Wall. But if they do, and they get control of the railroad leading to the south, then we, and you as well, will all be trapped. But this forecast is surely too dismal to be true. With best wishes, your Ellie from St. Remy. Foreshadowing, perhaps? Alright, well... Is it the right key for this door, by the way? So I just picked up. Yes, it is. So I might just drop it here, because I don't think it will be of use anywhere else. Surely. So I guess the idea is you rope up and grab the key out of his hand or something. Should have dropped the captain's key as well. But we still don't know where the captain's place lives, but we've got a whole new part of town to investigate. I was going to say it in the episode here, but actually it's not yet time to end the episode here. So I guess we have a bit of a look around. This part of town certainly seems quieter. A nice little garden. I should probably eat my food as well, unclutter my inventory, and maybe get some healing out of it. So... Right, that's the drop. So we're coming around to this corner now. So we have to fight up ahead, but the fountain fight, right? Well, here's where our mysterious man was. G-Man. First, that's G-Man. Anything hidden around the bed? No, on top of the cupboard? No. Scrolls I can't read. <laughs> it's terrible. <laughs> Banner that doesn't cut. The other one of that kind did. Maybe hiding something. Can't really tell. Blindhead Bridge. There seem to be more people fighting out that way. I wonder if the... Silver Gear... Hello. Yeah. 
of the gate. What was it? The water gatekeeper? Something like that. Oh, this this door has a doorknob. That's amazing. Not not a single door up until now has had a doorknob. I'm not sure why. Oh, there's a noisy floor. Yeah, that's what I'm afraid of. You are on holy I don't have an angle there, that's a torch in Shit. I thought I was hidden and I was in bright light. Hope they're too busy putting each other to come for me because I am not best equipped to survive if they come for me. That's not a door, this is a fancy place. There's another door up there. Not a door, alright, this is the way out then. So that was not the people fighting by the fountain, so I'm not sure what's. Quite sure where we ended up. I guess we're this is the bridge here, and we're in the wall here. That's the bridge. We came down here, so we're in this area. Oh, okay, so we're near that house that we couldn't get into. Thank you, apples. Healthy. Fancy looking bars, but it's a bait. Let's sell them all over here. Wait, do I know this area? No. Can I get back down if I drop back up if I drop down? Get back up and drop down. No. <laughs> well, we're on the other side of the gate. That's Pam's place there. Hello. Donald, Lever. I saw the big book might be interesting, but nope, nothing there of value. Oh, hello. This is the Watergate guy's guess. This is the guy who should have the big silver gear, the valuable silver gear for us. And we can get back to this part of town now. Okay. Also some apples. A little money. Right, there's a warehouse. It's a warehouse book, right, that I picked up, said, said this guy. The storage notes. Floodgate caretaker, one item, take special care of the... Well, this might not be the floodgate caretaker, but it does seem 
It's not a floodgate that we open, right? It was a person control gate, not a flood control gate. It does seem the most likely suspect out of anyone we've seen. But... Also can't see any sign of anything untoward. So maybe I mean he's this guy has this gear, right? This guy clearly likes mechanist stuff. Maybe there's nothing here. I don't know. I should put a question mark there, right? Four. Flood gate. Chair picker. Maybe. Ah, oh, somebody saw me. I'm thinking I can make it round there and keep finding out that I can't. Now oh, I can just go this way. So that's the guy that saw me and wanted to go chasing after me. All right. Everyone, this way. Are you? Thou shalt regret defying us. I'm not quite sure how mysterious man is supposed to be knocked down at all. Uh... Only cowards and the vilest weeds hide I wonder what the trigger is from disappearing. Oh, our fountain. Fountain mechanist won the fight. Bring thy numbers hither, friends. It's a lion fountain. The Lord of the Winds. Okay. somewhere else. That looks... Maybe I can break that? Feels like I can almost jump that. I don't know, it feels like a bad I have 
found foes more goodly hid than thou shalt regret it. This is a plug good caretaker. Okay. Hurry, friends. I shall cudgel thee. Yeah, I go ahead and cudgel. Bring thy numbers hither, friends. Lend me thy fuel. Hurry, friends. So we should be able to get into his house somewhere. Bring thy numbers hither, friends. Lend me thy fuels. Hurry, friends. Bring thy numbers hither, friends. Let me still see me. Let's lose line of sight for a minute. Bring thy numbers hither, friends. We can maybe knock him out in the fountain. By the builder, I've lost that scoundrel. Ah! Ah! Curse thee! Lend me thy fuel. Carous. Hurry, friends! Hmm. Thine evil stench shall unhide thee. Tis as if the very shadows swallowed him up. Oh, you saw me again. I'll smite thee when I find thee. Well, you know what? I'm gonna end the episode here. Staring at this fellow, and next episode I'll uh resume when he calms down and see what happens. So thanks for watching, and I'll uh see you then.